everybody. This is Jeremy. Um, I'm going to show you an application that I'm sure a lot of people have already heard of and seen and whatever, but uh, it's an application that is really, really nice. Um, it's for keeping people off of your computer. Um, I would use this on an iMac or a MacBook. Nobody really tries to mess with my computer, so I don't use it that often, but uh, if you have a MacBook and you you know, take it to class or, you know, take it anywhere where there's other people around that you don't know and don't trust. I would highly, highly recommend this. Um, it's called I Alert You. Um, there's no, like, real preferences up here for it or anything like that. Um, all it is is up here in the menu bar. It's just one little icon. Um, about I Alert You, it just tells you the version number, who, like, the company that made it. Um, it's a really, really small, simple application, but it's really nice. Um, go up here and check for an update. Um, you got your preferences. Uh, tell how long you want the alarm to go off. Uh, how sensitive you want the uh, motion to be on it, as far as like moving the mouse or uh, somebody messing with your trackpad or keyboard or anything like that. Um, you can set what you want to uh, trigger it, uh, which these are all for the uh, MacBook only, the ones that are uh, marked out that I can't click. Um, you got your trackpad or mouse, uh, keyboard, I've got both of those set. Um, it'll actually take an image, uh, if somebody has like, if somebody tries to open your MacBook, which this is why I said I really recommend this, because if, if it gets stolen, um, it actually takes a picture using your internal eyesight and then it emails you that picture. So I've actually heard a story of a girl that got her MacBook stolen and uh, I alert you emailed the picture to her. She sent that to the cops and they actually found the person that stole the uh, MacBook. So that's why I definitely would recommend this even more so for a MacBook than uh, an iMac. But, you know, it's good for keeping people off of your stuff regardless. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do this really quick and show you the uh, what it does when it locks. You just go down to ARM system and once you do this it brings up a screen and what I'm going to do is set off the alarm and then you just type the password. You don't like hit enter or return or space or anything to bring up a bar. You just type it on the actual screen so I'll show you that real quick. Um, you got to type in your password to set it and now that it's set I'm going to move my mouse and you're going to watch this thing go crazy. Okay. Now I go over and type my password in and it shuts it off. Um, it's that actually, it just took the picture. Okay, just now I heard it email it to me. Uh, I think it actually used my external eyesight to email it because I'm using the uh, internal to uh, do this. Okay. Um, and there we go, there's the picture, so if I was somebody trying to steal a computer, there you go, there's the picture in my email, I just give that to a cop, or take it to the police station, whatever, and hopefully they, you know, put that out on the news or whatever, and anybody that's gotten a hold of that MacBook, their face is going to be seen whether they know it or not, so, um, like I said, even if this is just something you keep in your home to lock your computer to keep your, you know, younger brother, sister, you know, whatever off of it, very nice. I would definitely recommend it, uh, especially like I said with a MacBook. If you take your MacBook out and you know to class and leave it or anything like that, which I wouldn't recommend doing anyway. But um, I just figured I'd make a quick video about this application. Uh, as always, I want you to su subscribe, rate uh, my videos, comment them, uh, any stuff like that. Add me, Skype, Aim, uh, anything. I forgot what else I have on here. Um, yeah, so uh, like I said, if you have video requests, just send those in, and I'll you know try to get you a video out on whatever it is you want. And until um, next time, that is all. Thanks.